Hello, and welcome to the 2022 Semester One Intake Orientation for the Master of Teaching. My name is Dr. Stephen Stoltz, and I'm the Program Director at the University of Adelaide. So I just want to take this opportunity to, first of all, welcome you, welcome you to the University of Adelaide, and of course, welcome you to the School of Education. I just want to spend about four to five minutes talking to you about the program uh, and some information that uh, is relevant to you. And so first and foremost, let's talk about COVID-19. Well, COVID-19, as I'm sure you're fully aware of, and we're in the midst of a pandemic. At the moment, we're all preparing for face-to-face -face delivery as a mode of delivery, so the mode of delivery we face-to-face. However, if for some reason things were to change, uh, correspondence, you will receive correspondence from the university in relation to what that will be. At the moment, I'm feeling quite confident that we'll have face-to-face -face delivery. And I'm really looking forward to seeing some of you back on campus again and engaging with you in a very different kind of way than virtual type teaching spaces. Uh, so I'm really looking forward to face-to-face -face, uh, delivery this semester and this year, actually. Um, in terms of a brief overview of the MTEACH program, as you can see here, in order to satisfy the requirements of your degree, you'll need to complete 48 units. And you'll see here, there's a breakdown that's color coded uh, according to study plan in terms of what you need to complete in terms of units. Uh, which units and which courses. And then it goes over the pages, you'll have two study plans that you'll have available um, to access. Uh, the first one being a two year study plan, and this is what it will look like when you receive it. Uh, and then you have the 1.5 year study plan or accelerated study plan mode, or what I call the accelerated mode. Now, just a word of advice to you, please enroll in the two year study plan. Um, of course, if your circumstances allow it uh, and you feel like you are able to um, enroll in the 1.5 year study plan, of course, you're more than welcome to kind of change that, uh, that study plan as you see fit. Just a word of warning, if you are balancing work, life, say family commitments, then I would say the 1.5 year study plan may not be for you, but of course, you'll make those decisions based on your circumstances. Both study plans are quite intense. Uh, even the two year study plan is quite intense, particularly when you factor for placement and when you factor for placement and so on and so forth and, and busy you know kind of work life say family commitments you'll find that two year study plan will be quite intense however of course that's your decision to make and I'm more than happy to have a conversation with you about uh, some of those demands and what's required of you as a student in the degree um, and so just I'm more than happy to kind of have that conversation with you as required. Um, anything to do of a general administrative nature, um, say course planner, university calendar, student administration team, um, you can access uh, the student administration team in three ways, uh, in person, by email or phone, and they can help you with any of those kind of general type questions. Anything to do with placement or professional experience, I would encourage you to contact Dr. Brendan Bentley uh, or Petra Galbraith. Just note their email addresses at the bottom there. Uh, and anything to do with the e-learning program, uh, Dr. Walter Bobbieri, uh, again, who will also be at the orientation if you have any questions for him, uh, but his email address is there for you. And of course, my contact details, just note the spelling of my surname there, it's just one T. And of course, more than happy to meet with you, uh, more than happy to kind of schedule an appointment as required. I just encourage you to kind of uh, send me an email to schedule something. The last thing I want to do is for you to pop in and I'm either not available or I'm too busy and so it's just best to send me an email if you do want to meet with me, say on campus at some point. I'm more than happy to Zoom or talk to you on the phone or email um, or meet with you in person, of course, too. Um, but of course, it would just be best if you just kind of liaise with me directly uh, because my schedule is quite busy, um, particularly during the semesters. Uh, and so just note my email address there. I want to wish you all the best with your study. I'm really looking forward to getting to know you in a lot of my courses, and I hope to see you on campus. Bye for now.